Hey, welcome back to Grow Your Meds. I just want to show you guys my uh, custom made aeroponic system that I make. Uh, it's really cheap, you can make it yourself, if you're a little handy. Um, basically, I just use all your standard parts you can get at Home Depot, like this air pump, these bathroom cups, and uh, I got this is just uh, some uh, peat moss. So, you can use any medium you want to uh, supply it. But basically, I just drill six holes in here. To, uh, it's a two inch hole with the hole saw. And what I did, let me show you the inside. <coughs> uh, let me take this off a lot. So, your inside is basically your sprayers. So, your air comes in over here your airline fits right inside that straw and the straw goes down and the straw actually has you can see is some small pinholes in there I just use the uh, tack that's how the diameter of those holes just have to let some water in and what will happen the water will fill that little manifold here the straw and the air pressure will push it out the top and that will never get clogged and uh, to replace a mister it costs about two cents so yeah this is uh, by far the most efficient aeroponic system you can make I think you can buy it and uh, yeah so let me show you so that's how I make my aeroponics it's pretty simple um, yeah, I'll show you the bottom of this net pot here It's just a uh, charcoal screen, hot glue to the bottom, cut the bottom off the cup, pretty easy. So the roots can come through and get splashed by the water. Let me give an update on my uh, oil here. This is the uh, results you get after the uh, alcohol is all evaporated out. This is about 10 minutes after I poured it in here, strained it. And uh, I'll show you what I do to uh, finish it off to get it out of there. And it's the best what to do this warm. Uh, once it gets uh, cool, it'll basically be almost a permanent sticking to the pan here. You know, the, to the Pyrex dish. So I'm going to put you down. I'm going to scrape it up. I'll show you what you get. You just get a basic razor blade. Start scraping up the sides first. You probably want to best start with a nice clean razor blade. Don't use anything used or anything. Pretty straightforward, comes up pretty easy. Scrape it around. I'll show you what I have left after it's all scraped up. Yeah. You know, Look at all of it, don't worry about it. Just get most of it up. You can get it the rest of it up in the next run. You'll always get it eventually. If not this run, then second run will pick up. And I'll zoom in and show you the color of this. Now if we did this with, without being cold, this color would be completely black. But as you can see, it's not really black. It's like a golden amber color. Let me get a little closer. Basically, you just scrape that off. This is about a half a gram, maybe a quarter of a gram. But it's uh, very high quality. And uh, just a dab of this probably stop seizures if this, would, if this was a high CBD oil. So hopefully, uh, now people can make their own oil without diluting it with uh, grapeseed oil or other oils. It's not concentrated enough. This is as concentrated as you'll ever get. And I'm sure you can purge it and stuff like that, but uh, other than that, this is the most easiest way, quickest way to do it. Get it done in one day, same day you get your material. All right, take care.